Hi everybody, it's Melissa here again, and I got some more stuff in. I wanted to go through it with you guys. Um, I have to say this is the first time I've ordered from my favorite things, but I've heard really good things about them. So I was actually really excited getting this box. It's a little mints in there. Um, and it was super quick. They actually, um, I ordered, I want to say I ordered on a weekend, and it shipped very quickly, so I was really, really happy with the whole process. Like I said, it's the first time I've ordered from them, but um, just really, really liked it. Just good customer service in general, so. Um, I've heard great things about their cardstock, so I was really excited about that. Um, I got just like a sample pack since I am just kind of new to ordering from them. So it's supposed to come with just a variety, a few sheets. Oh, I like the weight. The weight is really good. It's not not flimsy, but it's not too too heavy. Which I like, especially for card making, because if you get too flimsy, the cards fall apart, you get it too hard, and then it just doesn't work. So, I, this is their sample pack, and as you can see, it just comes with samples of some of their different shades. So, looking forward to getting into these. Um, so, yeah, so we should be stocked on cardstock for a little bit at least while we're doing cards. And then I was really excited to see that they have craft cardstock because I use craft cardstock like it's going out of business. So um, it was actually really decently priced too. I don't remember exactly what I paid for it, but um, it's the same weight I'm sure as the other samples. It's just all craft paper. So yeah, it's a good. Definitely a good weight. I could totally use that for my bases or even a mat. So, um, anyway, craft cardstock, cardstock sampler. I also picked up some of their dye ink pads, and I don't know. I just I really like the fact that you can get the ink pads that match the paper. Um, and I use craft so often I had to get the craft stamp pad, ink pad as well. I ha like again, I haven't tried them, so I don't know, you know, how they react with different things. But um, I was really excited to see that they had an ink pad and craft because, like I said, I use craft paper like all the time. And I just got a couple of other random colors that I use. I got the jelly bean green because it just sounded fun. And the Razzleberry. I saw a video where another person was making a card and used the Razzleberry and it just looked really pretty. So I picked that up. And I think there's a couple pieces of the cardstock in the sample packet. And then, of course, we're getting ready to make some baby cards. So I got the little Dynamics onesie. I think it's just called Baby Onesie, yeah. I thought it would be cute to make some little thank you cards for the shower, and we'll see what happens with that. So, again, never tried their dyes, so it'll be a first, but that video will be coming. And then I just got their cute little mini banner day alphabet. It's a very small stamp set, but they are individual letters. I don't know if you can tell. Um, but there's individual letters, so you can actually spell out what you want to spell. Well, that would be cute, maybe you to use with their die. So, looking forward to using that. Um, again, first time I've ordered from them so far. It's been a great experience. I've never used their products, so really looking forward to diving in and taking a look at how their products work and how they stand out. So. Um, check out for some card videos coming soon, I promise. I'm going to have a lot more time on my hands here in a couple weeks especially. And uh, we'll see you back out there. Thanks again for watching. Bye.